What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Liquid Crystal walkthrough. Okay, so, in our, I think it was our last episode, we won our 12th badge, and that was against Janine, the Fuchsia City Gym Leader. As many of you guys already know, Janine is the daughter of Koga, now the Elite Four, an, uh, an Elite Four member. Now, right here in this episode, we're going to be going all the way to Lavender Town, battling every single trainer right here, and, oh god... Oh god, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of like, you know, kind of, I kind of don't want to, but I kind of have to because, Jesus, there's so, so many trainers, but the good thing is that we have the speed button, so it's no biggie right here. Now, I would like to say something, I would like to say that, you know, hey, you know, we are very, very close to finishing up this walk right here, I've, uh, as many of you guys already know, that I, I'm, I'm excited, like, I've, I've grown a well, not not grown accustomed, but I've I've uh, I've had fun with this game, with its discoveries and all that stuff. Uh, just a few episodes ago, you just saw me just re react to uh, uh, the you know the finding of Charmander and all that stuff. Now I'm kind of thinking that you know you might be able to find uh, all the other uh, all the other uh, starter Pokemon from uh, the Kanto region and all that stuff too. Maybe even at Professor Oak's office or you know lab and all that stuff. And I also brought up the idea of uh, what's going to happen after Pokemon Liquid Crystal is done. And it's very simple, guys. I've talked about it in the last two episodes, I think. Maybe maybe even more. But I brought up the I brought up the subject of Pokemon Soul Silver. I did say that, you know, I played it twice, twice before, and playing it again would just be doing the same thing over and over again. So I decided that, hey, you know what, maybe it's time for me to make a change right here. Let's go ahead and play Pokemon Heart Gold. And that is exactly what we're going to be doing, guys. Once this whole walkthrough is done, once we get, once we obtain 7,000 subscribers, which, yeah, we're not that far away, uh, we, will be we will be playing Pokemon Heart Gold. And it's probably going to be like a, a weekend kind of thing where, you know, you're seeing a... You're seeing a, a game a weekend every single weekend, probably five games. I don't even know five episodes per weekend, depending on what it is. And you know, hopefully, hopefully I actually what was it? Um, well, yeah, hopefully I, you know, hopefully I, I record enough episodes to to actually get me by when when and when this this uh, this whole uh, what you might call it this. This whole pandemic ends. I don't think it's going to be any pretty time anytime soon. But once they let us back to work and all that stuff, because I kind of feel like we are going to go back to work sometime soon. And uh, well, you know, Draven, he's a hard worker and everything. And look at that. And oh my God, come on. And there we go. Defeated. And Charmeleon. The goal is to actually evolve Charmeleon right here because eventually I'm probably going to be using them on, on my team right here. But yeah, guys, uh, Pokemon, Pokemon Heart Gold, that's the new, uh, remake walkthrough that I will be making, or that I will be playing, and I already posted it up on my community page, uh, choose the starter, and so far people want me to use Cyndaquil again, so that's, that's fine by me, uh, there just might be a few changes going into the game if I were to play with Cyndaquil and all that stuff, so again, guys, go to my page if you want to vote for the starter, for the Pokemon starter and all that stuff, and, well... Psychic attack. There's no need to waste this Luster Purge. And well, let's go with Shellgon right here. He's a, or she's about to evolve. So probably should just beat the crap out of it. Like a weak Pokemon and all that stuff. Get some experience points. You know what? Oh crap. Wrong Pokemon. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna keep on asking this every single time, but how are you guys doing out there in YouTube land? Uh, despite this whole shutdown and all that stuff. Are you guys doing well? If, for some of you guys who are high school seniors, I know that some of you guys are high school seniors and all that stuff. Uh, how are your grad, your quote unquote graduations? I know that you know you guys won't be able to watch, but you will still get your diploma and all that stuff. So, like what I'm trying to say is, my heart is with you. If you can't, you know, move on, you, you can't graduate, walk with your friends and all that stuff, do the high school thing. My heart is with you guys. Trust me, that, that is one thing that you probably wanted to have. And look at that! Shogun is evolving, finally, into Celements. 
or Salamence, or I don't even know how to pronounce that name. You see, this is the reason why I came out with Pokemon Go. That way, I can or Pokemon uh, P or P Pokedex Pro, 3D Pro, and stuff. And look at this, Salamence. Oh my God, that's a beastly Pokemon, and automatically it learns Fly. Probably the only Pokemon that can actually learn an HM move. And uh, well, there we go. Now, the reason why I wanted to evolve, uh, what was it, Bagon, all the way to Salamence is because I've never did it before. Like, I want to use it for, for a little bit because, like I said uh, a few episodes ago, eventually we're going to have to start using a set team because, well, we're going to be battling a whole bunch of other strong trainers, not from here, but from another region as well. And, well, let's go ahead and try our Salamence. There we go. Cosmic Power. Dragon Breath, Meteor Mash, Ember Attack, Paralyze, Burn, Headbutt Attack. There we go. What's with the Moonlight? Okay, so I just gotta, I gotta beat this girl pretty quickly. There we go. And, god dang it. There we go. Critical hit, eat that. Alrighty. Okay, so... Let's see, Charmeleon still has a few levels to go, so let's go ahead and battle this guy. We're on the field trip to Lavender Town Radio for social studies, okay, so let's go ahead and battle the- Oh, look at that, okay, so we might have a chance here, maybe not. Let's see, uh, okay, Salamence, and we gotta switch you out with Erwin, I know, I know. Erwin's a water type Pokemon, but this is what it is. Okay, alrighty. Sweet sense. <laughs> We're getting, uh, we are getting, uh, blown away and all that stuff. So here we go. Ice Punch on Weeping Bell. Eat that. And we almost get rid of this guy. So let's go. Ice Punch. Eat that. And bam. We do our thing right now. Okay, so here we are. Route 14. And... And we're going to be battling this guy right here. My dream is to fly with my beloved bird Pokemon. True. True as true. And we're going to be switching out right here. Let's go. Let's go with Erwin right here. And Ice Punch. There we go. And Firo has been defeated. Look at that. And we're just going to continue on right here. Look at that. A lot of these Pokemon trainers are at a very, very high level right here. Probably something that, you know, the creators, the actual creators of Pokemon, like the Nintendo, should have done when we were playing, you know, Pokemon Crystal, Gold, and all that crud crap baskets. We need somebody with cut. Okay, so we're going to have to go get our cut. Somebody, a cutter or something like that, so we're going to have to replace somebody. I think I already know who we're going to be replacing. Actually, we're going to be replacing two, probably two team members, just because, you know, and it probably benefit us in just a little bit. Okay, let's see. Where are... Okay, so right here. Because we're going to be going through an area where there's a lot of cut. And maybe this is a good idea to actually, like, train a Pokemon here and there. Okay, so let's go to the depository right here. So I'm going to put Claymore back right here. And I'm going to put Salamence... Oh, wait. Has an experience here? Oh. I didn't... Well, I didn't know that. Okay, so we're going to put Selmans back, and we're going to bring out two Pokemon that we probably need. Let's see. Um, so I heard that you can actually evolve. You can evolve the Pokemon that you can get through trades, like Haunter and Kadabra. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring out Haunter right here, and... Let's see, Orchid, let me see what you got. Okay, so you, I could bring that Pokemon out, but who else has cut right here? Like, internal monologue right now. Let's see, let's see, somebody, somebody useful. Lord Needle has cut, okay. Uh, well, you know, actually I do need a Pokemon that, you know, I will be training up and all that crud, so let's see. Let's see, let's see. Actually, next goes straight to move Pokemon right here. And let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, so you know what? We're going to have to save this whole evolving these uh, traded Pokemon later on. I might have to do this off screen. So I'm, I want to put Nido King in. And 
let's see. Poor kid, you're gonna have to come in with me too. I'm gonna have to teach you cut. And that, that is that. Okay, so let's go right ahead and where's the TM? You guys gotta love the internal monologue that I have because <laughs> I'm kind of uh, doing this all on the fly. So let's see, I have some pretty good moves right here. So let's go with reflect. Okay, and actually let's go right ahead and let's go right ahead and grab this this uh, experience share and give that to Charmeleon because we kind of need to we we kind of need them to evolve without any switch battling. So let's go back to the long road to Lavender Town right here before it starts raining again. Look at that, I'm erratic. Radic right here. Okay, so let's go right here. Okay, so let's see. We are back at Route 15, and there is literally nothing here except for this. Not that. This, and we found ourselves a, a PP up, which is the Pokemon Viagra. Okay, so that grew mysteriously, and it started to rain. So let's see. We go behind here. We are skipping all the trainers and all that stuff. Okay, so... Actually, hold on just a sec. I kind of want to check what kind of Pokemon we have right here because... Who knows? There might be a Pokemon that I might want to capture. Put on the team. Let's see. Talk to this girl. Chansey's cute, but I don't have it. Do you have a Chansey? Want to trade it for an Aerodactyl? Oh, crud. Okay, so... Let's see if we can find a Chansey here. That's pretty... That's a pretty sweet Pokemon, eh? to have, so let's go right ahead and Great Ball, Crap Baskets, there we go, alright, Oddish is with us, I, I think this is the place where you can actually capture Chanseys, because if you can, then I'm about to do that right here on screen, come on, stay on my, stay on my Pokeball, ah, let's see, you can't get hurt, by with confusion if you don't do anything. Alright, so let's see. Chancy Chancy, where the hell are you? That's a good Pokemon I want to have, and there's a Pidgeotto. Alright, let's see. Oddish again. Let's go again. Ditto, we already got a shiny Ditto, so we don't really need a Ditto anymore. And, well, they're pretty rare right here, so... Okay, so nothing right there, nothing right there. Come on, where the hell are you? Damn you, Chansey. It is like 1%, below 1% probably. Never mind. Okay, so we're going to have to save that for later on. We're going to have to start battling people right here. Hi, did you know Pokemon get more friendly if you train with them in the place that they remember? Yes, I do. Okay, so let's go. Going up against Trevor. And, well, let's go with the Mega Horn. We're definitely going to be battling... Uh, we're, we're definitely under-leveled right now. There we go. And there's a Screech Attack. Crap a Potion, you got to love that. Crap Baskets. There we go. Come on, one more, one more! And there we go. Okay, so let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon because that was... That was kind of a weird, and uh, you know what? Shroom Lee does have its own potion-based kind of stuff, so let's see. All right, we're already over here, so let's go right ahead and start. Let's see, this is where this is normally where you where you would always find Suicune in the Heart Gold Soul Silver series. Not here, and here we have. Uh, let me sell you. Okay, prize Pokemon. Okay, so let's go. He's got himself a Bulbasaur. Strength Attack. Synthesis. Strength attack, eat that, there we go, Charmeleon goes to level 34 and is learning Flamethrower, alrighty! And, well, let's go right ahead and switch out to Erwin right here. And, let's go, Surf attack. Squirtle, okay, perfect Pokemon right here for Shroom Lee. And, let's go with that Mega Drain. And, okay, Hydro Pump, <laughs> oh man, this Pokemon will not let me beat it. There we go, and Squirtle has been defeated, alrighty. So he's got some pretty good Pokemon right there, doesn't evolve them though. 
Okay, so here we are in Route 13, and of course we don't have headbutt. And well, let's see, this has become a maze, pretty good maze. I kind of feel like there's like an item here, a hidden item that you can actually find or something of something of importance. Let's see, Lavender Town, a Fuchsia Town, a Fuchsia City, and let's see, there's nothing right here. Nothing right here except for this guy. Let's battle this guy. He's got himself onyxes. The sand slashes. Go. God damn it, Kenny. Got your uppercut and oh crap, baskets. This guy is gonna. There we go. Level 35, and we're gonna still keep on going. He's got himself his golem right here. Alrighty, okay. And look at that, Charmeleon grows to level 36. And, well, let's go straight to Erwin right here. So, Charmeleon might skip out on the move here. Yeah, he's going to skip out on the move once he evolves, so... Go, and look at that. Defeated this guy right here. So now, BAM! Charmeleon is finally evolving. Drinking, I'm drinking um, my water here because uh, that's a lot of talking right here. And look at that, got ourselves Charizard. Okay, very good Pokemon. Of course, it, since it evolved at level 37, it will not learn its wing attack. I will probably have to teach it. Probably have to teach it wing attack afterwards. But look at that, Hasty Nature evolved it within two episodes, and. Okay, so it can learn. It, it could definitely learn more, but right now we gotta keep on going. And this place, this maze right here is kind of. Um, let's see. Oh, okay, so we should have gone right behind the guy right here. Okay, let's go right here. Right, uh, where the hell are we? God dang, this place is like it's ridiculous. Okay, here. Oh my god. So let's go right here, we're progressing, and there's more trainers, but then, again, there's something right here. Probably, I don't even know. Why do they add these freaking, ah, oh, goddamn trees? Alright, here we go, battling this guy. He's like, bow down before my regal Pokemon. Oh, he's got himself a Needle King. Okay, so we gotta switch out Pokemon right now. So yeah, this is what I mean by like training up my Pokemon just a little bit better now because uh yeah, the, these guys are gonna they're no joke. And uh, yeah, we definitely don't wanna mess with these guys. Okay, so he's coming he came out with a slow king. And I'm I'm in quite of a pickle right now. And there it is, there's that pickle. So let's go with that slash attack. Swagger. Okay, so come on. Go, come on, there we go. Okay, so let's go with Orchid. You know, we're gonna we're gonna level it up right here too. And speak of the devil. Okay, so let's go right ahead and lot to this. Our luster purge! God damn Pokemon will not die. Here we go, Orchid grows to level 33 finally, and we gotta revive our Pokemon now. Okay, let's go right here, and it's Shumli. God damn, this has been a full episode of just like getting our butts kicked and everything. Okay, so let's see, where is a full restore when you need one? There's one. Pretty sure I bought some uh, some other. Actually, you know what? I gotta save those for later. Yeah, I got myself more hyper potions than anything. So here, okay. So let's move on. Let's get the frick out of here and. Oh wow, there's really nothing here, except for these god dang trees, and, oh wow, okay, so are we close to being done here, because, okay, so I see double trainers, alright, check out my Pokemon, just look at the color, and it's image, okay, oh, it's not a double battle, oh jeez, okay, yeah, I should probably brought more Pokemon right there, nice punch, 
All these Pokemon trainers are at level 54, which is pretty cool, but god dang. And look at that, Charizard level 39. Let's go ahead and battle this guy. And here comes with a Farfetch. Now, Farfetch is a little bit of a strong Pokemon. A lot of you guys, including myself, wanted an evolution for Farfetch, and I think it got it to, in, in the Galar region. But a few days ago, I, I posted out like a, uh, what was it, an article of like, what was it, unused, uh, unused data or unused, you know, plans for Pokemon and all that stuff. And Farfetch had a female evolution. Remember that now. And wow, we just got out of there pretty quickly. Okay, so before we do anything, let's battle this guy. Do not let leave any unst or stone unturned and all that crud. And wow, he's got six god dang Pokemon. Okay, Pikachu. Oh yeah, he's got himself Pikachu's all the way. So here we go. Pikachu's all the way. There we go. Low 40 Charizard. Go. And I'm gonna continue going with the with this whole thing. Let's go and finish him off. There we go. And Charizard grows a little 41, which is always great too. Okay, so what we're gonna do right here, guys, is we're gonna stay put. In the next episode, we're gonna continue on our adventure to uh, Lavender Town and then hopefully, you know do a lot more good things out there. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next.